All right, thank you, Milani. All right, y'all. Good looking out. Okay. Good looking out, Milani. So look. Y'all come on in. Y'all come on in. Come on in, come on in. I got a question for sure. Keezy Teddy. Keezy Teddy. The F I V. The A the I gotta figure out how to say this. I know it means something. The A five. The A the A F I V. All right, y'all. You know, through all this shit we've been talking about the last couple of days, right, y'all, the last couple of lives. Gentleman Tone. Okay, what's up, Gentleman Tone? Jessica Irving. You know, look. Let me ask y'all this. Okay, sure, initials. You two perspective of a step in uh, your 702. Let me ask y'all this, y'all. T motherfucking Y. Jeezy Smooth. Jeezy Smooth. Look, do y'all think, right? Do y'all think that there's any hoes that really love hoeing? You see what I'm saying, y'all? Like, you know, it's pimping that's really, really loving this shit, right? Or is it deep down, are all these hoes wishing they was doing something else, y'all? You know what I mean? Like deep down inside, do you think all these hoes is wishing, man, I can't I can't wait till I gotta stop doing this one day? Or or is there any hoes out there really, really proud homing? You see what I'm not I mean not I mean of course they're proud at the time, happy at the time, probably like we you know when they first start. But what I'm saying in the long run, like is there really hoes that's really like, you know, you know, I'll be <laughs> I will fucking trick till I made it in my pussy falling off type shit. You know what I'm saying, y'all? Like, that's the thing. Or are all hoes just really trying to hurry up, get out the game, hurry up, get this, hurry up, and you know what I'm saying? And oh, I want a pimp so I can hurry up, and that's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying, y'all. Some might. Yeah, of course so. Balance. Good question. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? And I'm just saying, like I say, does it does the hoeing really, you know, is there any ride or die hoes for the hoeing? You see, you said them hoes stay busy. Right. Right. Okay. And I know it too, y'all. You know what I mean? I, I know there is some. Uh, you see what I'm saying? But it just seemed like lately when I be talking to these hoes and I be asking them, so like, you know, what you're looking for or, you know, it's a pimping or this or that. You know what I'm saying? Lately, that's all I've been hearing, y'all, is the, is the, oh, I want to, I want to, um, you know, grow and elevate. And, and you know what? I think, y'all, we got to stop saying elevate. That's starting to become like a trend word or something. Marinetti, you know what I'm saying? I think, I think, I think, I think people just start throwing the words too, like loosely, and then now everybody want to say elevate, just to say elevate. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I think. Let me find out. Let me find out, y'all, what it say elevate, just to say elevate. You see what I'm saying? Because at the end of the day, motherfuckers, that, that's the first word. What do you expect out the gate to elevate? I think motherfuckers don't even care about no elevation, to be honest. To be honest. I don't think they care about no elevation, to be honest. I think they just be saying shit to just be saying shit. Mr. CP, you think ele you think elevated slick talk, T.Y.? Y'all think elevated slick talk? For real, y'all? Let me find out elevated slick talk. The real Montana, steady flossing. Is elevate slick talk? Can't elevate past the game. Only thing elevated is their blood pressure. Well, let me know something, y'all. Let me know some. Let me know it might be a little bit of pimping in this motherfucker. 
God damn. Let me know I might be a little bit of pimping up in this motherfucker with me. God damn. You see what I'm saying? Let me find out they saying elevate just, just to be trendy, y'all. Let me find out. Let me find out they saying elevate just to say elevate, y'all. They don't really know what this elevation is. Hey, shout out to Mr. Skinny. What Mr. Skinny said y'all the other day? Mr. Mr. Skinny, he said, he said, he said, I don't want to go to no elevate. He said, what he say? He said, he said, he said, I don't want to elevate. He said, I'm finding a level I'm at. And that's pimping. <laughs> I said that's right. I said that's right, Skitty. He said, "What Skitty say, y'all?" He said, "I'm finding where the level I'm at, and that's pimping." <laughs> hey, what CP say? They can't elevate into the game. Fuck you, niggas ain't in the game for real. Okay, look, y'all. Y'all say that in the comments now. Let somebody come here and talk about elevate. We'll see if y'all got that same energy. Cause y'all know I go on one. They don't care about elevation. They want a man. And they want to elevate with that man. The reason they don't be with squares because a pimp is the only one that accepts them as hoes. Yeah, but they don't even respect it though. Do you see what I'm saying? Ho, oh, if you was eating wings, now you eating lamb chops, bitch. You elevate. You crazy, Ty? Thread bum nigga don't know nothing but no elevation. Thread bum nigga don't know nothing about no elevation. These bum niggas don't know nothing about no elevation. Oh yeah, man. And like I say. I get it, y'all, but something just told me, like, I think people are just hearing it a lot, and that's starting to be like a trend. You see what I'm saying? Because we know it ain't no time to this, y'all. It ain't no time to pimp it. So if you're going to elevate, what you going to elevate into? Some more of it. Some more of what? Pimping. That's why when they be like, oh, what's happening, man? Or oh, just some more of it. You know, when y'all hear, just some more of it. What you think just some more of it is? What you think the it is? What you think the it is? Or just some more of it? Some more of this gang, some more of this pimping. You see what I'm saying? So so that's the thing. That's why I say, you know, maybe maybe they want to say transition. Maybe they want to say transition. So exotic bully, 11 play girl, Mooney bands, what's the deal? Caribbean currency, some more of it and not enough of it. For real, presidential PZ, let me know something. Juke to 16. We find out you juke the pimping. Oh, look, juke to 16. Juke, what you, what you, what you, uh, you juke the pimping, you running, uh, you fake the pimping out, juke. No, I'm just messing with you, juke. I think for the ones that this shit just come easy to, yeah, the ones that struggle are still trying to figure it out, may question themselves. Okay, I could dig that. I could dig that, Mulani. I could dig that. I could dig that. G Gov the governor. Rose Gold about it. Like I say, y'all. So that's the thing. You know, um, you know, but like I say, y'all, you know, so that was that's what that's what was just on my mind. You know what I'm saying? Do these hoes really is there any hoes? Caribbean currency. Is there any hoes? Do do you feel like there's hoes out there that really love their homie? You see what I'm saying? As far as not just wanting to hurry up and get out the game like like his hoes deep down wishing that damn they can't wait for the day they can stop hoeing. Or is there any hoes out there that's really looking at it like they wish they could just hoe forever type thing? You see what I'm saying? How's the hoeing looking at it? You know? How's the hoeing look at it? You know, because you know as pimps the pimpin got the slick talk. G Gov G Gov told us about the slick talk, y'all. The the pippin the pippin gonna have the slick talk. But what about the hoes? Oh look y'all, does hoeing got slick talk? What's the hoeing slick talk? What's the what's the what's the hoeing slick talk? I think I think the hoeing slick talk is calling themselves queens. No. <laughs> y'all know y'all gonna kill me for that. Hey, that hoeing slick talk is your bitches calling themselves queens. You know what I'm saying? He's some hoe, bitch. Ain't that better than the motherfucking hoe? But like I say, what's 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 the hoe and slick talk? What's the hoe and slick talk? Daddy, okay, yeah, hey, daddy for sure is a motherfucking trick word. Slick talk like a motherfucker. Huh? She might slick talk that trick out some money. Okay, that's about it, huh? That hoe and slick talk. Oh, 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 there we go. 
Oh, I get it, y'all. The hoe and slick talk is for the trick, huh? Oh, any slick talk the hoe got for the trick? No, nah, hope forever. I know women that got dope, good paying jobs that want to come back to the game because they missed the hoe and life. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I think for the one, what's up, Mufasa? I think for the one to look at it as a quick buck, they can't wait until they get out of this. Right, 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 right. Right. But see, the thing is, is, but what about the, but for those, but for those who this, their life, they may want to elevate and get better, but never turning back on it. They don't want to cook fries for their hustle. What's between their thoughts? Oh, look, and you know what tripped me out, y'all? If that a trick, you might as well say gentlemen is a trick word as well. Oh, <laughs> that's why, you know what? That's why they just got to call it pimping. That's why they just call it, got to call it pimping. Damn, I had a cold ass thought in my head. I just forgot. I hate when y'all be doing that shit. I be thinking of something. I be reading. They don't want to cook. Oh, I remember because this comment made me think about it. They don't want to cook fries. Okay, look. And what y'all think about this, right? What y'all think? What y'all think about them hoes, right? That say this. That say. What, what y'all think about the hoes that say? That got, was y'all in here when the girl was in here earlier? And she says she get in the she 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 got in the game because she was good at what she do. Remember her, y'all? She says she got in the game because she was good at what she do. And I said, what was that? And she said, good at having sex. <laughs> so how y'all look at that? So what? So 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 what's up with the bitches that got in the game because they was good at having sex? This is huh? Think about it, y'all. Because they was good at having sex. Then that's when I was like, well, what about the business side? Oh, I was good at business too. See the phone. I, you know what I'm saying? And that's the thing. So the one that's good at having sex or they're good at what they do, that's why they got in the game. Then would I have been wrong if I asked, is she ever busted in up with the trick before? That's what I'm saying. Look, you said she just like fucking. That's what I'm saying. She just like fucking. That's vicious. So now, what's up with the prostitute? That just like fucking. What's up, London? What's up with the prostitute that just like fucking? Is she the one that's doing the GFE? London, you got to help me with this, London. London, one of y'all, one of y'all, one of y'all holding these comments got to help me with this one. Like I'm saying, no busting us. No, but look, y'all. Shout out a lot of them do so. Just tell me about it. Man, London. Can you come up and talk, London? London, I want to know when you ask a bitch what well, well, why did she decide to get in the game, London? And she tell you and she tell you because she was good at what she do. And I said, and then you ask her, like, what you mean? Like, to say she's like, you know, yeah, I know I'm good at having sex. I know I'm good at having sex. What kind of shit is that? It's always them GFE babies for you. And that's where it starts, huh? London, how you doing? Oh, whoa. London, hey, so, hey, stop by me, son. What's up? Okay, so look, so I asked the bitch, I say, so what made you decide to get in the game? Oh, you know what's for it? And she said, Oh, because I'm good at what I do. And I'm like, oh, Okay, wow. so like 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 sex, right? She's like, Yeah. And I was like, What about like business to be oh I'm good at that too? But and I'm like, Okay, so you oh, started God. the game because or you want to get in the game because you're good at having sex. Now, is does that seem like a common answer that a hoe might give? I mean everybody's that shit. That shouldn't be a con that shouldn't be an answer, period. Um, poor baby. 
Damn. Poor baby, that hit hard. I forgot that... her name, y'all. If y'all remember who that is, tag that girl. She said, poor baby. <laughs> poor because, baby. I'm because I'm thinking, now if that's the case, like even if, even if a bitch started like that, if that's the case, but then she started getting money afterwards, I mean, the money would still just be a bonus because she started. She's doing it for free or something like, like. See, that's another thing. A bitch who's a bitch who's doing it just because she feels that she's good at sex. How can she be focused on up, up charging and getting more money, or would she just be satisfied with the sex and the money she got as just a bonus? You know what I mean? It's just all bad all around. Baby ain't got no game. Poor thing, thing. Yeah. <laughs> Think about that, y'all. I don't know, ladies. Just don't go that route, you know. Um, you shouldn't be in this game for that reason, you know. Um, damn, I'm still stuck on her answer. I'm sorry. That's deep, though, because she probably really feel like that. And nobody's never taught her or gave her, you know, no type of game to – or gave her a reason why she's in the game or whatever. Oh, that's just bad. It's just all bad all around the border. Yeah, I mean, cause I feel like that's a big sacrifice yeah. once a woman decides to do that the first time, you know? There ain't no turning back. I mean, you know what I'm saying? I mean, you already did it. But... <laughs> they said better be in a swinger. <laughs> better off Let me get back to We out here barbecuing again. This shit is crazy. I just tapped in because every time I see you going live, it'd be interesting. So I had to tap in. Okay. Thank you, London. You're welcome. Y'all have a good one. Okay, that's a little bit. Okay. And then, man, she always a breath of fresh air. Hey, look, y'all. Shout out to London one more time. So, look. Shout out to London, man. My bad for the thing. If y'all couldn't hear me, she always a breath of fresh air. Hey, she said, poor baby. Y'all hear that? Y'all hear that? See? Matter of fact, let me tag that girl. What's her name? I think her name was, uh, what's her name? Uh, was it Nina, y'all? No lovey W. What's the deal? What's her name? Nina? N N I I. Oh, I found her. Bam. Invite. Oh, uh, she ain't here. She ain't here, y'all. She ain't here, y'all. Because I sure would like to talk to her. Because like I say, you know, and this is another thing, y'all. What up, Price? This is another thing, y'all. I know it's about 90% squares in the motherfucking comments, right? However, for any of y'all that is in this game or trying, right? You ever ask y'all's hoes that? You know what I'm saying? Why'd they even start? Why'd they even start? Why'd they even start? And for all y'all that be trying this little pussy tired, <laughs> look, if, if the nah, look, and then for all y'all, you see what I'm saying? And this is for all you um all the pimp and like I said, okay, who a pimp supposed to fuck? Okay, I get it. I get it, right? But the thing is is if you can refrain, right? What's the what else what it's like the hoe is looking for you and you for something that makes you superior and separate from any other man other than just the pimping, quote unquote. Other than just the pimping. You see what I'm saying? Her boyfriend fuck. The tricks is fucking. You know what I mean? She might have been molested, God forbid. You know what I'm saying? By her uncle or stepfather or something. You know what I'm saying? Third cousin, that type of shit. You know what I'm saying? What what about that one man, right? That still love her, like all those, all those people I just mentioned. You see what I'm saying? But he ain't never fucked. He wasn't worried about the pussy. You see what I'm saying? Because a lot of times. What y'all don't realize is sometimes when these bitches is, is, is giving you the pussy, right? That be the y'all don't realize that. Y'all don't realize she feel like she doing something like, like. <laughs> listen, listen, that's business. That's what I'm saying. Y'all ain't gonna get this game. 
Yeah, I ain't gonna get this for you squares too, but mainly y'all squares anyway, right? Fucking ninety percent of y'all. But y'all gotta realize when a bitch is giving you pussy, that's her. That's like, you know, and you that's her validate. That's that's her. That's that's like you validating her in a sense. Sorry, pussy. <laughs> for real. For real. You know what I'm saying? What's one thing different that you could say? I love being able to tell my hoes like bitch, and I ain't never fucked you, bitch. You see what I'm saying? All I gave you was pimp. I ain't, I ain't never fucked you, right? Because deep, deep down, they might think like, man, yeah, I'm giving them my money and I'm giving them a pussy, right? And this is another thing y'all got to realize, too. You sitting there fucking your hoe, right? Yeah, you might think these bitches are the best actresses. You might think you would have given her the best dick or good dick, but you can't even think like that. They fuck the tricks, right? Now, I'm not saying that. But for you to think that you could compare with a trick, you know what I'm saying? Or with, you know what I'm saying, with the fucking, you can't. So look, so now watch this. So now you sitting in here, you know what I'm saying, you being real disrespectful to the bitch. You see what I'm saying? You, you're just being a certain way of being because you know you can. You see what I'm saying? And you're treating her way. Now remember, she giving you all the money, right? Then you got the trick, right? He's just trying to, you know what I'm saying, just Prince Charming every time and he probably has more money than you, pimping, you know what I'm saying? And got the good job and she wouldn't have to have to work and on top of it, y'all keep thinking these tricks is is like like old scrum you know, old men. There's some fly tricks out there, y'all. There's some fly tricks looking like Leonardo DiCaprio hopping out of uh uh, uh <laughs> Bentley's and shit, you know what I'm saying? You know, smile like, you know, YSL, you know. So the thing that I'm saying is is and then and then and then on top of it all, he's fucking the bitch better than you. That's vicious, huh? Now you just got knocked for the trick. Now you just got knocked. You just you just got knocked by the trick all because you see what I'm saying? She was paying you. You was treating her some particular type of way. And what fucked it up is you was fucking her. <laughs> and she didn't even like it. <laughs> That's business. That's what y'all. That's what y'all missing. You would have done better than fucking her. You probably would have kept the bitch. You see what I'm saying? You probably would have kept her because she didn't know your dick was trash. <laughs> hey, I'm telling y'all some real shit. I'm telling y'all some real shit. You know what I'm saying? Hey, hey, hey. You could have kept her if you didn't fuck her. Because she wouldn't know your dick was trash, nigga. You see what I'm saying? Now she go. Now she go. Now she go. You see what I'm saying? So smooth motherfucking Lou. Let's get our Lou in on, y'all. <laughs> what's, what's the deal, what's the Lou? Hey, There's some funny shit you're saying right now. Yeah. You know? Yeah. Come on, Lou. God damn. What? What are you doing? Fucking rinsing off the fucking wheel. What's well, it's loud. Well, what you want me to do? I mean, God damn, bro. I'll press mute a second. I'll press but mute look, a second. Go ahead. Okay. So, look, Lou got the 24 karat gold, y'all. Hey, yeah, hey, we looing. We looing. That's the new thing, y'all. And yeah, we spreading that. We going viral with that. We looing. We looing. We smooth looing. For real, you know? we we getting our Lou on. You know what I'm saying? Shit. Go get your Lou on. Hey, baby, you come get your Lou on. You know what I'm saying? For sure, we Lou it. Definitely. Pasadena Drake. So, look, so back to what I was saying, y'all, right? So, that's the thing. That's the thing. So, y'all, you know what I'm saying? So, y'all want to fuck the bitch? Fuck. Okay, fine. But it could be doing more damage than good. Watch out for the quiet bitch, too. You know what I'm saying? First, they want to earn your main. <laughs> Learn your main right. Watch out for the quiet bitch. You know? You know? And like I said, you know, like I said before, oh, she's testing my pimping. She better test, she better test your pimping. She's paying for it. She'd be a fool not to. Looing like a motherfucker, for real. Like, he said, looing like a motherfucker, for real. Planes, trains, and automobiles. <laughs> you ain't got planes, trains, and automobiles. 
Oh, look at that motherfucker. What's that, some 20s? Oh, well, we all knew. Oh, yeah. Those are 22s. Don't disrespect oh, me like that. My bad. 22s. All right. I see. I see. 22s. I see. I see. 22s. Don't, 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 don't disrespect me like that. I see. My bad. <laughs> looks nice. <laughs> looks nice. That's the, that looks nice. That's nice. But see, you ain't got the Benz emblem in the middle. That's what I'm saying, Luke. You ain't got the Benz emblem in the middle of the rim. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? 20s ain't that bad. They ain't that bad. The motherfuckers are 20s, y'all. The motherfuckers are no 22s, huh? Tell Luke, he think we was born yesterday, y'all. He, he wanted to think the motherfuckers were 22s. The motherfucker was 20s, y'all. I don't fuck with some twenties. You want to fuck with these things some twenty twos? I don't fuck with some goddamn. We know what the fucking twenties look like. I don't fuck with sitting low too. I want goddamn twenty twos. I'm fuck with some goddamn twenties. You know what I'm saying. Nah, <laughs> I was just talking. I was just talking, y'all. But look. So yeah, like I say, man, that's just that's just a little something. You know what I mean? That's that's just a little something. You know, that's just a little something, man. Because it's like, man, it's vicious. It's vicious, y'all. This shit is crazy. You know what's crazy? You know what's crazy? Look, this was crazy, too. This was crazy, too, y'all. If y'all ask women, and I, <laughs> look, I don't know why I brought this topic, but I'm still talking about fuck it. So look. <laughs> hey, y'all. I don't know why I'm on this topic, but I'm still talking about fuck it. No, look. But this is another thing, too, right? Of course, if you're going to fuck, right? You're going to want to please her. I'm sure. I'm sure, right? You're going to want to make her make her come have an orgasm and y'all don't know what's the difference between these bitches is coming and having orgasms too you know i know that's two different things y'all know that's two different things right oh bitch bitch you know coming and having an orgasm y'all know that's two different things but what i'm saying is is this right so y'all fucking so y'all fucking now how many y'all hoes gonna be honest out there and tell them how hard it is for y'all to come and have an orgasm Y'all gonna be honest? Y'all gonna be honest? Lou. Yes, sir. You ever gave your any of your hoes an orgasm before? Of course. How you know? Because I know. How you know? Because I know. See? Well, Hold on. Fuck is an orgasm. I'm 45 years old. Don't try. N N I, shit, I didn't have my first orgasm until last, like two years ago. So am, am I? So I? So I, so I ain't lying there, right? Oh no! But you know what it is, though. Huh. These bitches be out here having sex, and they just think it's like you don't. People don't understand. I mean, I guess it's the men too. Like you don't be like I didn't get around a man that was like, are you like, what's like, what's up? Like you ain't. It, it's like you know. Like I'm not trying to be too explicit. A lot of these. Shit, we grown. Fucking. No, we grown. <laughs> People be motherfuckers just think like, okay, well, we just fucking like, you know, when I was younger and I had I lost my virginity at 17. And I remember after that having a feeling of wanting to have sex and not even knowing what it was about to my big sisters told me like, you ain't never, you ain't never came or you ain't never had an orgasm. I didn't know it was two different things at first either. And she like, nah, so she like, you supposed to get yours before he get his. And I'm like, what? How, like, how that supposed to work? She like, nah. But the first time it ever happened to me, I thought I was pissing on myself or something like. <laughs> I don't know. I really, honestly, didn't know what was going on. I'm like, I tried to hurry up and get up and run. He's like, nah, bitch, sit your ass down. And that's what, that's what it is. Like, I don't know. It only take only certain motherfuckers to bring it out of you. Also, though, I found out that when I'm, I like to be choking. Look at Lou talking like, about some. Mm -hmm. My bad. Go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck you laugh? Don't laugh at me. No, cause Lou, no, no, cause Lou no. talk about. No, look, when well, you he said it takes certain motherfuckers to bring it out he of you. you. When well, you said it takes certain motherfuckers to bring it out of you, Lou over here like, mm-hmm, like. <laughs> Shut up. 
Shut up. Don't do no. me. But yeah, it do. It no, definitely no. does, though. From best, like and then from, and and from what you're saying, it's definitely a true thing. Like, and then you got some men that don't even think about satisfying a woman. They just think, oh, they let me just. They not on. Huh? They'll just want to get their own nut off. Exactly. But, you know, women don't understand, too, that you're supposed to get yours before the man even get his. And then what you learn also is this moaning and shit, all that fake-ass shit. Like, that shit hella fake. A nigga think because you moaning, like, oh, she about to come. Like, nah, you should, this should be a change in her voice. The bitch should be shaking, legs still moving after, like, all type of shit. Like, yep. And men wonder why, place. like, I've had a couple experiences with me, and they wonder why, like, I just, I hit it and quit. Like, I don't be wanting to talk after or nothing, because I'd be like, it was, a, it was like, you petty. It was a waste of time. Like, even you felt if you like you just dirtied yourself? You felt like you got dirty for nothing? <laughs> <laughs> hey, yeah. I felt, I felt like that, but I beat it. Like, with this one particular situation, I was the aggressor. Like, bring, like, come here. What you, like, type shit, like, you know? And he was just, I don't know, he was like, you real cute, but I don't, I don't know. And then I was hella skinny, so I don't know if he felt like he was hurting me or what, but niggas be, it just, I don't know what it be with guys, but it be some guys, like, if I can't finish, if I finish too fast, bitch, I'm finna finger you, make sure you get some type of something, but I feel like all that is a waste of time. If you ain't got no stamina, don't come a bitch way, because the bitch will talk about you so dirty. And niggas don't even really talk about bitches like that. You barely, rarely hear people talk like, you know, unless it's a man. Like, oh, she got some whack-ass pussy. Other than that, as long as he get his nut, he don't give a fuck. He don't even know what bad pussy is. <laughs> right. No, no, you're right. You're right. So, and, and, and that goes on top of me saying, so a hoe that caught herself paying some pimping mm -hmm. on top of a nigga that ain't fucking her. Do you see what I'm saying? I mean, but you know, with your folks, it's like you're not getting, especially if you're not the only bitch, you're not getting it like that all the time. So I feel like it's his job to really make a bitch come and fit. Yeah, because we're not getting this every day. Yeah, we are sex workers, but it's the, you know what I'm saying? I haven't had, like, that's, I've been trapping. I'm still trapping and shit, but I haven't had a consensual sex. I mean, of course, I'm not being raped by tricks, so I guess I am consenting. But it's like, you know what I'm trying to say? It hasn't been a sex partner to where I'm like, oh, I'm attracted to him. I just want to fuck him. Sex or... for pleasure. Sex for pleasure. You mean you yeah, exactly. Okay, thank you. Pleasure. Thank you. A pleasurable sex. Yeah, sex for pleasure. So it's like, you know, when you do got folks and he don't have time to be laid up under you, ain't got time to be laid up under him, and then you don't want to get too dick dizzy anyway if the dick that good. But besides that, it's like, yeah, when you got folks, you only fucking here and there. And so, yeah, he should be fucking the shit out of you when he is and making sure you straight. Like, you good, bitch? Right. That's what I feel, you know what I mean? Because all the other freaky shit is not going on. And I don't know if I'm disconnected from the world because I am a sex worker, but I don't even like my pussy and shit like that. Right. That's why liking bitches only go so far. Because I'm not about to be licking on no pussy and you're not licking mine, but I just don't like it. Right. I know exactly what you're saying. No, no, I know exactly what you're saying. And that's what I'm saying. Y'all y'all be wondering what happened. <laughs> y'all, what happened to my bitch? You see what I'm saying? We definitely, we definitely women at the end of the day, too. Like, you know, and if we giving you all this money, we attracted enough to you to give you all this money. Fuck our motherfucker. Look, that intelligence, that mind beat everything. Even if you got folks that's not so attractive. And nine times out of ten, that's just like food. They got to be appealing to my palate and my nose before I even... You want to, you know what I'm saying? So it's either your game is just immaculate and you hella ugly, or you had some as fuck and you do got some game too. So I'm, hell yeah, let me, uh, you know what I mean? And then I learned to have a certain respect for the game. Also, like when I was first turned that I had folks that to where it's crazy because he's one of the biggest, but he's a very well, well known rapper. And it was just like, I hated having sex all day, every day. Like I hated it. Like, and then I'm not getting nothing out of it type shit. Like I hated that shit so much, but he was very handsome and shit like that. Bitches be it's crazy. If I if I'm around a bitch that I don't know that's my ex folks and they listen to some music, they're like, oh okay, and they thinking this and that and they don't even know it's not that. Right. But at not the end of real. the day though, show at the end of the day, was she really your bitch if she left you behind not giving her some dick? No, 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 no. But understand that it's more than as a woman. Let me tell you this. I mean, I can't speak for everybody else, but if I was in that situation, let me tell you that. If, that means you're not giving me no personal time, period. 
when do you uplift me as your woman? Yeah, I'm your goer, I'm this and I'm that, but you my everything at the end of the day. I didn't have a motherfucking sponge stuck in my shit and my folks would be like, bend over, bitch, I'm gonna pull it out. Y'all can't get it out? Let me pull it out. Like, you my doctor, you my lawyer, you my protect, you my everything. You my teacher, you, uh, you my everything. So if I'm not getting that quality time from you and feeling like I'm something to somebody that's my that, everything, why I'm gone. To, why I'm out of there. Why does quality time have to be sex? It don't okay. have to be sex, but I'm a woman at the end of the day. I okay. want to, I, I, I'm going to want to fuck. I'm okay, now, another thing, another thing. So quality time also, that's a love language. So it also depends on It's who, too. You know what I'm saying? I'm it on depends, with it. Yeah, so it depends on who's, on who's on the woman. You know what I mean? Lou, but also to, to answer your question, Lou, it's just, I'm saying on top of everything else is what I'm saying. Yeah. Your dog and a bitch. Not house, just because kid. of that. Not just because right, exactly. You know, you know what I'm saying? That's the thing. I'm just saying. What you're saying I'm, is right, Lou. It's not always, it's not to interrupt y'all gentlemen, but it's also another thing to where it don't got to be sexual. I just might like to love the way my daddy smells and the way, love the way he pimp oh, he handles I just your around you sometime and have time. Mm -hmm. You might, you might, you might get, you might get aroused by the way he handles your business. You Man, it's a, by the way, I don't gotta ask for nothing. I don't gotta say I'm hungry, bitch. You got some money in your pocket. Yeah, you could go kick it with your friends after you do. You know what to do and what not to do. Handle this man's money and go do what you. you know what I'm saying it's, mm -hmm. it's, it's, it go both ways. So no, it's not always about intimacy, but it's like eventually, yeah, it's gonna be about that. I honestly, as a woman, if you just, I'm just paying, paying you, paying. I'm not a robot. I'm not out here eventually having it. all these hoes like to say, well, I don't fuck tricks. I do this. this I, I, it's some tricks you got to fuck. You know what tricks you could get over on. You know what tricks you could say, oh, babe, I'm not a full service girl. You know what tricks? Okay, I'm about to have to get down because this nigga, you know, as a woman and as a trapper, you know, but yeah, at the end of the day, I'm doing all of this. So yeah, I want to have sex at the end of the day because 90% of it is me handling your business and you doing what you're doing for me. Also, the other 10%, I need to be treated like a woman. Also, it's more than hair, nails, and clothes. And now, let me credit. No, for real. Now, do, you, do you date black chicks? Um, I mean, honestly, I try not to be disrespectful because I am a black woman also, but I just then a lot of women, not not to cut, um, go away from your question, but women say they don't date black chicks because black chicks got they're a little more hung. Now I've been around black clients that to where it's so small, it's inside of they whatever. It's that that's small not the reason why. Get it out. Yeah. I've been around white tricks to where I've absolutely been all the way. I'm not fucking hell, no. Nah, this man dick is too big. Right. So uh, to answer your question, it depends on the situation. I never see black clients for. A quick visit. I never see black clients for a half hour, but I will see you for that hour so we can sit down, you know, chop it up. You want a massage? Let's, it's not, oh, I only got this much time, mama, so let me just fuck the shit out of you. I'm not letting nobody fuck the shit out of me. What? It's that. It's just the point of having control over your session. Black, white, Mexican, Puerto Rican, shit, the Craigslist killer was a white man. Wow. Yeah, but then I just heard somebody say black chicks are problems. Every problem I've had, I've had with a motherfucking Latino or the other day when I was just almost kidnapping. All that shit just happened to me last week. You was almost that kidnapped? Was by a Mexican. Oh, yeah. What state? What state? What city? I'm out here in California. I'll definitely be in you all. In but Cal so I'm scary. in California too, but where? But where, where were you at? Huh? I was in Sacramento that night. Oh, up there in the oh, up northern, up northern. So what happened? Basically, well, the well, I'll just tell you the whole story, then I'll tell you the scariest part for me. But um, I was with my uh, white partner, so that's the now that's different too. Unless you a polished black bitch, I won't trap with you. I'd rather trap with a different race, and I hate to say that. You said polished. They don't know about polished, baby. Then she said polished. Let me know something. Uh, Go ahead. Yeah, I'm from now. I'm from San Francisco. I, it's definitely in me, not on me. She said polished. Okay. Um, but yeah. So what happened was he, uh, I was with my white partner, and um, he had pulled up to us, and he was like, he saw my partner. She was, though she dressed real. She was the opposite. You know, you know certain blades. I'm just not like that. It's that I gotta be in LA or something to be real fully naked. But she don't give a fuck, and I respect her. So she draw down, and when they see our faces, they be like, "Ooh, I like this little black bitch." So he um he pulled us to us, and he uh my partner like, "Oh, I've seen him before," but she's the type of bitch, and that's why I stopped kicking it with her. It wasn't nothing bad, but I just don't like your rapport or the way you do shit. She like, "Oh, I know him. He cool." 
he gave me this, he gave me that. But she got everybody, her cousin, she got a bad habit of doing that. And this is the lesson I had to learn. You know what I'm saying? So anyway, she like, he cool. He gave me this last time. And he only did this. And he only wanted this. He was cool. He real quick. And he ain't no problem. Okay. So I walk up to the car. He like, um, I'm like, what's up? He like, hey, you working? I'm like, yeah, I'm working. He like, um, I'm like, obviously. He like, well, what you, I'm like, you know, basic questions. What you looking for? Da, da, da. Well, how much you trying to spend? He like, I got $120. I'm like, I can do something quick for that. But you know the usual. You get in the car, you want more money. Do a little bit, you want, of course. Y'all know the game. But anyway, so I'll get in. So he started driving away, first of all. First and foremost, I only do my outside dates at one point, And then I always had a little rinky dink ring right here off Stockton. So it's never no reason to be driving me no other way. So he like, I just don't want to go to that room because this, this, and this. And at that point, in the back of my head is so crazy. Cause I don't know if y'all heard about the girl Lacey and all the shit that happened in uh, Vegas. Lacey was in the back of my head because I was just talking to uh, Matt. Yeah, that's, that's Lou's goddaughter. Huh? That's Lou's goddaughter. Oh, I'm so sorry, Lou. Oh, but Lacey was in the back of my head. That's what saved my life. But I was just telling Mac this. So um, in the back of my head, I'm uh I'm already thinking of, I don't know how she popped up. I'm already thinking about her like man. And so he I look down at my phone, I look up, he driving a whole another way. I'm like, oh no, he's like, nah, I just went that hotel, it's nothing like that. Your partner said I told you I was cool, right? So he playing off of that. Mind you, this bitch ain't never seen this man. They don't even know each other. At this point, I'm thinking after it was over, I thought I was set up type shit. But she he like, nah, she told you I was cool. Like I hear he look, I'm showing you, I'm like, it's nothing, I'll give you the money now. So we hand him the money, whatever. We pull over. It's a cool little residential area. I'm like, okay, if something do happen, I'm going to be able, I'm going to have an upper hand. So he, uh, so I jump in the back seat. So he walk around to the side and he open up the door or whatever. So he kind of, mind you, um, he got leather seats and I'm in like this, uh, I don't even know what kind of, I mean, it's something like polyester, this whole little bodysuit skirt, I mean, dress kind of. So he pulls me over the seat and I'm my whole, like, you know, he was able to pull me and I'm, the first thing I do, I'm such a hoe, I look up and look back. I'm like, oh, babe, I need, don't, like, don't be grabbing me like that. Like, I don't like to be grabbed. Or, and before I knew it was like, he was like, nah, bitch. He like, get a, come, he like, come here, bring your ass here. And I'm like, what? So this nigga strips me asshole naked, runs through my shit. Mind you, and when I'm in sack, I don't give a fuck if the date was only $100. I'm going to put that shit in my car or whoever I'm with, I'm putting it up. So I didn't have nothing on me. So, but I'm telling him, I'm like, mind you, so I'm seeing what he, I'm like, I don't even have nothing on me. He like, nah, bitch, get out the car. So he pulled me out the car. The the uh, door is open, so it's kind of like blocking me, but we on a residential street. You can see from any way, but it's dark. So as he got, I feel something so cold in my back. Every time he touched my back with it, I kept shivering. Like every time he touched my back with the gun, I kept shivering. Like, oh my, like I just kept shivering. So he like the scariest part for me was this part when he like yeah get back in the car bitch so i get back in and i'm sitting in the back seat he walking around and i'm sitting there like this man finna what are you finna do to me you done already figured i don't have nothing on me but some fucking condoms and a purse and a phone you're not getting my phone you're not getting like what are you trying to do you figured i don't have nothing what made you throw you back throw me back in your car like what was like i don't get it so is he walking around i swear to god i don't know what it was after hearing the full story with your goddaughter no disrespect. The first thing I said was, I can't freeze up. I'm like, Lacey didn't freeze up. I can't freeze up. Like, and her situation was worse than mine. I'm like, I can't freeze up. I'm like, I cannot freeze up. I'm like, I got to do something. And my mom just passed too. So I'm thinking in the back of my head. I'm looking. I'm like, Mama, I don't know what to do. I'm like, please, I got to get out this situation. And for some reason, I had already knew I was through. So I'm like, I'm not even finna reach for the lock. I know I'm through. Like, I know he got his child safety locks on. And I swear, I swear, I don't care if nobody fucking believe me. Lacey hit my mind one more time as I'm trying to talk to my mama. Her spirit came through and some said, open the fucking door, bitch. And I reached over and I opened the fucking door and the door was unlocked. And I got out that car and I ran. And he chased me up and down the block. And for the life of me, I couldn't understand that he figured out I didn't have nothing. What did you want? What did you want? Like, that shit scared the shit out of and me. This, and, like, this was, and this was after? This was after the date? And this was, we didn't even date. This was after he had stripped me and figured out I didn't have nothing on me. He threw me back in the car. And I'm, he, why is he walking around? It's one of them big F4 150s, I want to say, but it's big and nice. 
enough for him when he walking around the cop for me to have enough run time to think like so it wasn't like, what the fuck because I, I don't know I, my dumb ass just assumed like he gotta have a child safety locks on if he threw me back in here like this and some just told me to reach for the door and i reached for that door and i jumped out so fast i didn't know what to do i didn't know what the fuck to do and it's so crazy because after that a trick seen me running down the street he's like you okay i'll pick you up i'm like my room right there he's like here put this coat over you and the bitch that he said some shit to me to where I just pepper sprayed the fuck out of him and took all my anger out on him. He gonna say, oh, yeah, I saw you running naked. I was wondering what was going on with you. I'm happy I got to see your little sexy ass body without spending on money and just dropping you off. And I just, before I did anything to him, I looked at him and I'm like, I'm obviously in tears. I'm frantic. I'm shaking like a fucking stripper in a hole in church, like a fucking dog. Obviously something just happened to me and he looked. He like, yeah, I got a daughter too or something, something, something. But yeah, your body did look before he could repeat those things to me. Because mind you, we hear a lot of shit as sex workers, a lot of perverted ass shit that make our skin crawl. But it made my skin crawl so bad to where I didn't even think my dumb ass, I'm in the car with him. I just pepper spray the fuck out of him and just start beating the shit out of him. Like with everything in me, like how dare you? Like, so, and, and he was in a truck? Yeah, he was in a, uh, okay, y'all, I'm going to say, whoever in Sacramento, if y'all want to DM me and let me know, I mean, I will DM y'all everything I know about him. He is in an orange F4-150, and on the side, there's white writing like he owns a company. Now, okay. now let me ask you. The first couple letters of his license plate and shit like that, so if anybody trapping a sack, like, in the most respectful way, peace, you know what I'm saying, ho, whatever, inbox me, and I will send y'all his information. And it's another guy in a black uh, charger picked me up, and so he had brought me to a park, and it was crazy because he he had his he only had a hundred, so I agreed to you know do the top. I'm like I can't do the bottom, whatever. And um, he was like okay, and so when we had got out the car, also mind you, I don't even do no walking in the park, whatever. He was making it real weird for me anyway. And then he had said some shit like, yeah, just, uh, I left the money in the car. Like, can you just do the services and I'm going to drop you off anyway? I'm like, no, I need cash before anything. This motherfucker got up, tried to swing on me before I motherfucking knew it. It was just, it was just crazy. Like if I, I don't know, I really feel like I'd be having guardian angels watching over You do, over me. you do. And what race is he? He was like, he wasn't black. Because I will not take a black chick off the blade. That's what I will not. I got to have full. If I take you as a client, it I got to, it, it takes some shit. But you also, nine <laughs> times out of ten, as a black guy, you also have to have a reference. Like, because I want somebody to be able to say you cool or this or that. Nine times out of ten, I'm not taking no clients without a reference or without you passing my screening. It's not no punk ass screening with your age and nationality. No, that's out. Right. Not, not no Millie. Now look, now look. You ain't known that. No, ain't nobody never told you not to be fucking with trucks anyway. No, I've never seen some of my best tricks is in like some of my best Mexican ass tricks. I spent hundreds at a time, and my my regular that found me off the blade and spent nine hundred and been breaking me off ever since. And I ain't never really seen him again. He just sent cash shots and shit. He drive a little pickup truck. Well, just be careful with them trucks and vans, especially vans. vans I won't no get in the van. I will not get in the van. Okay. You know, some other shit. Everything bad. I'm from the Bay. I'm from San Francisco. I'm from right. Fillmore. Anything the bad that has ever happened to me happened to me in Sacramento. Right. Like, and that's just the craziest shit that is just mainly like you would never think. But yeah, being from the Bay, the mania shit that ever happened to me happened to me out here in Sacramento. And that's like a couple months ago, I had a dude, mind you, I saw that it was some little gangbangers, I guess, trying to rob tricks and hoes. As soon as we pull up, mind you, I'm telling him, I'm like, just pull over right here. Some name, right? Like, this cop keep following us. So as soon as he pull over, the dude jumps through his window. I get out and run. The dude, like, grab the bitch. Grab the bitch. <laughs> I'm like, y'all so fucking stupid. <laughs> At least the jackers in Oakland wait for you to be in a cop for a good five minutes, and then they walk up. Like, you said so grab the bitch. That happened to me in Oakland. I, I hid my money, and a dude that was robbing us, he like, you can get out, little mommy. He got some more money on him. I'm like, I think he do. Let me go. He like, nah, but give me your money, too, and I'm going to let you leave with your car keys and your phone. Now, let me and ask I'm you like, this. I'm all I now, got. I'm like, now, really, now look, now look, man, now look. <laughs> now, through all this, these things, mm -hmm. you still getting down on that blade? I mean, 
I'm a hoe, so I'm gonna continue. I'm gonna push through, but it's certain things I look for, and and yeah. And, and, the, and, the, and the reason why I'm asking is this, sweetheart, right? We oh, have I'm a lot of talk about people saying this, saying this. Oh well, that's why I don't play the play because it's dangerous and that. But as a hoe, that's really out there, really hoe. How do happen. you do that? I feel like, like someone making a comment like that. Go ahead. I, I feel like being at the Craigslist killer came to them hoes' room. And he okay. was a white guy. So all this, I only date white clients or I only work in rooms or I only what you what you mean? You in this game, it's gonna happen to you. All you can do is pray and, and you know, be the best you can be to other people and hope that that's reciprocated. you reciprocated right. onto, onto you. So other than that, it's nothing you can do to stop this game from being this game, baby. It's gonna always be not just like an adult. It's gonna be people that's that bad business, set up artists, people selling flowers that are they dope. I, I didn't gave a motherfucker some ice, some ice cream salt, telling him it was some other. You know what I'm saying? So I done been through some shit. I know my karma. The, you know, like I didn't been through it. So I, I never give up. I just move a little different, a little bit smarter. And then I even take some game, like you said. Be careful with them pickup trucks. Don't fuck with no van. Okay, right. you right. I'm going right. to put that on to the, if I feel like you right, I'm going right. to add that on to my, you know what I'm saying, my cautious list. Right. And then, and then, then I'll ask you this. So say with that, with the first situation, or the, mm -hmm. first, the first story you told us with the, with the orange truck. Now, him, yeah. what, what did you learn from that situation? Tell me what you learned from that situation. First of all, I learned that whole say is no say all the way okay. around. Okay. First of all. Hey, I bet y'all ain't never heard a whole say that, though, huh? Y'all ain't never heard a whole say it, though. Whole say is no say. Unless I've been through it or my wife he been through it and I know a bitch and I know she a hundred and gonna keep it real and tell me how she fucked up, too. She ain't just telling me this trick out here. Don't You, you letting me know where you fucked up, too. Now, where I fucked up also... Sorry, y'all. Whole say is no say. And all money is not good money. I had a room. Why would I let this trick take me all the way down another street? Oh, baby, you don't want to go to my room. It's the reason why this nigga don't want to go to your room and be caught in no camera. And it's not because he married and got some kids at home. Because if he was a polite trick and came in and did what he had to do and walked right out of my room, he wouldn't have no problems about his wife or a girl. Any of that wouldn't be no problem. So, yeah. Be, you know, it, it's like so, oh, so, so right no there, so, all good so, money is not all money ain't good money. He didn't so want to go to my room. Than, I could have got out and caught uh, uh, four dates in that time. I had so, left. So with what him. I'm saying, but look, but look, 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 so so you compromised in that time where you know you shouldn't have. Oh yeah, it's a lesson. I, it was a lesson and a blessing. It was a blessing that I got away and that my angel who's with me. You know what I'm saying? And my butterfly was, was flapping around, a.k.a. Lacey. So I knew so. You know what I'm saying? So it, it, it's like, it, 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 I can't just and I won't. You know what I'm saying? Like, I, I always wanted to go on my like Yeah, I, I've changed up a whole lot of the way I get down. And I'm very vocal to other women. Even if she ain't my wife, you watch out for that truck right there if I see him or, you know? Like. Right. You just got to. Look at that! Look at that shit. That was a lesson and a blessing. Right. All money ain't good money, which I've always heard that before. But I, and as much as I try to act like I'm this, yeah, I'm from the bay. I'm real quick on my feet. I'm sharp. I'm this. I'm that. I should have known in that moment that all money ain't good money. If you didn't want to go to a comfortable room, you just was a little trap room. You don't want to go to a room and sit down, sir. Like I don't know, no. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But I've also had cool clients too that say I just don't want to go to no room and be on nobody cameras, and they didn't been cool. No, but I know it's what you just, mean. So now I'm just not willing to compromise. Just... Even if you are all young, but that money just ain't meant for me, baby. Even if you are, and a you good know client. what it is though. You know what it is too. It's this. Yeah, yeah. Don't compromise. It's you standing in full control. Compromise is 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 agreeing to something that works out. Uh. uh when Lou say he favorite. don't play the track for these your reasons, do y'all still agree with him? I uh, mean, anything you gotta understand. Not to interrupt. What's you, compromise mean, y'all? Somebody out there tell what compromise means. Compromising, I feel like means definition to go against. Two. No, but, but to go against how you feel. No, and, like what I did, I compromised the with the trick. I, I, sorry, the, go ahead. No, the, the definition though. Like, do you have another phone? Uh, I do, I do. No, no, because it's gonna be worth it. It's gonna be worth it. Look up compromise. And then look up definition number two. 
Yeah, he never wants number one. He always wants the No, second. no, no, because number two, I mean, there are definitions. He never wants the goddamn, the, the real one. Okay, hold on. I'm grabbing a phone to look it up on the internet right now. Okay, watch, y'all. And, and we use words, right? But then sometimes when we really look up and really, what does this word actually mean? You know what I'm saying? Right, we get right, to right. really learn some shit. Well, my mean and my, what I mean when I say compromise is like what I did with the trick. I went against something that I knew wasn't right to say, okay, let me see it your way. But it could be a whole different definition. I could definitely be ignorant on that. Hold on, just turned on. 19, 19, okay. This song's so slow. It's working with me, though. Hold on, it's my trap phone. But uh, to answer that question down there, when um, no disrespect to P. Lou, because he's a definitely respected, a respected gentleman in the game, and I respect him, you know, period. But I feel like it can happen both ways. I just like the shit that I do on my part time, the skits and scan, whatever I, you know, moving people, print, doing stuff, whatever that I do on the side, it's nothing for a guy to be that fucking, hold on, compromise. Hold on. Uh, I feel like it's a lot of people.